Uh, the final race then of day one is the PWC Chase. It's a two mile one furlong on grade three. And the top one is Baron Scroop for James Shea. Chess for Leon Van Rensburg. Distance up and Gold Naive System for Craig Allen. High intensity for Ryan Tamasebi. Lock and Kai for Graham Clutterbuck. And Waleshi Otto for David Robertson. The Count Joshua Sutherland. The Grey Teller for Ryan Costello. Fiorenti Paul Rhodes. Friday Girl Jim Murray. Greek Kingdom Paul Rhodes. Limelight Craig Beckwith. Rhythm Divine Leon Van Rensburg. Romney Saison. Ryan Costello. Sinking Orange Daniel French. And Vanilla Delight John Morgan. Big field then and away they go. Get their way towards the first of the fences and it's the grey vanilla delight for John Morgan who is the early leader as they make their way towards the first of just nine fences they've got to take it's only a two mile one furlong and it's Van vanilla delight in front and sit at a pretty decent pace leading by a good three or four to Mualeshi Otto in second and comes Friday girl in third one or two of these being pushed along already and vanilla delight is going comfortably in the lead. It's a long old run to the first of the nine fences. And Vanilla Delight will surely lead them into it with Moleshi Otto second. Friday Girl third. The Grey Teller is up there nicely for Ryan Costello in fourth. As they finally get to the first, uh, they've all got over it. There are one or two dodgy jumps, most notably by the second of the Paul Rhodes horses, Fiorenti. Uh, one struggling at the back is Baron Scroop as they take the second, also slow at the back, Romney Saison. So the pace is catching a few of them out as they come up past the stands then. They've got a full circuit to go after this. And Vanilla Delight is the leader. Amoir Lesciotto is second and the Grey Teller is third. Friday Girl is four and the count is five. Then Chess is six and Lock and Kai is seven and then Limelight. And Gold Neo System was after that one. Fear entries recorded from that mistake. And they passed the winning post then with a complete circuit to go. And the leader, Vanilla Delight, is in front but only by about a length now to Mualeshiotto in second. Gap of a couple then to the second of the Greys, who's the Grey Teller. Then Lock and Kai going well around the outside. The Count and uh, Chess are after that one with Limelight going well as well on the inside gold by a system is also well placed fear into just being pushed along for a few strides there then rhythm divine as they get to the third which they've all got over safely baron scroop though is out of shot and struggling as two is romney saison as they take that ditch which they're all safely over the one struggling at the back now is distanced up but it's Vanilla Delight in the lead. Vanilla Delight and Mualeshiotto from the Count and Lock and Kai as they take the fifth. They're all over that one nicely. And Vanilla Delight being scrubbed along to keep the lead. Gets over the sixth and jumps it really well. The Count's over it nicely in second. Then Lock and Kai and Mualeshiotto. And then Limelight and Chess after that as they take that ditch. That was the third from home. Look at that one sweeping around the outside there. That's Greek Kingdom being chased by Rhythm Divine. But it's Vanilla Delight who's in the lead being chased by the Count. These two are clear of Mualeshiotto. So Greek Kingdom is making good strides up the outside and the one that's coming through on the rail is Friday Girl. It's still over grey. Vanilla Delight in the lead then. Vanilla Delight leads by about two and a half lengths to the count in second. Friday Girl is third. Two more to take. Then Moaleshi Otto. And they've got to get to this Vanilla Delight. Vanilla Delight powering away in front. It's Vanilla Delight coming down towards the second last fence then in the PWC chase. Leads comfortably by three or four. Friday Girl is in hot pursuit in second. Then comes the count. Moaleshi Otto Chess trying to run on, so too's Golden Land System, but over the second last they go, and Vanilla Delight is clear, Vanilla Delight's got two furlongs and one fence between her and Victory, she's clear of the fast finishing Moale Otto over that final fence they go, Vanilla Delight still in the lead, but the pack are closing, here comes the count, Moale Otto, Friday girl, Vanilla Delight coming to the end of her tether, she's been in the lead on her own all the way, she leads still by a length and a half, but the count and Moale Otto are trying to get closer, Friday girl's got to be trapped for room, it's Vanilla Delight still in front, half a furlong to go, Vanilla Vanilla Delight by half a length. The count in second. It's still Vanilla Delight. She's hanging on and she's got to take it. Vanilla Delight wins it. The count in second. Then Wally Giotto. And high intensity finished well as well. Baron's group never got going at all today. And what a brave performance. Looks as though she was going to take it easily. And then when that chasing pack got close, it looked like it was pretty ominous for Vanilla Delight. But she's hung on and won it. A really, really good performance. Stayed on grimly. You couldn't put it better, could you? Vanilla Delight takes it for John Morgan. The count for Joshua Sutherland was second. Moir Lesciotto for David Robertson, third. Uh, the fourth place horse was Friday Girl for Jim Murray. Uh, when the card drops back down, we'll confirm fifth. And fifth was Gold Naive System for Craig Allen.